Oh, here we go. Leagues has been released. Let's get in there. Here we are. The shore lies just ahead. It's time to wake up, hero. Our voyage is coming to an end, but your journey is just beginning. Hey, let's get our characters set up. Why not? All right. That, yeah, we're looking good. Welcome to the latest event, hero. I'm so glad to see you made it in one piece. Well, I appreciate it, sir. All right. For my combat class, I'm going to choose Masterful Wizard. Probably not a shock. Magic is super OP in the early game, so let's grab this. There we go, we've unlocked the magic skill and the arcane conduit fragment. Hey, there we go. Reach tier two. Look at all this. Improved pickpocket chance. Okay, so maybe we should go start with some thieving. Let's find some stuff to do. I would like to pick some wheat to start, I think. Yee, there's a task, picking some wheat. And we're going to pickpocket this woman. There we go. There's a task. Uh, yeah, thieving's probably where I'm going to start, so let's get to it. Two thieving. First level up. We're gaming. And my first level five. Is that five thieving already? Holy cow, this is going fast. Oh, I got a fragment. Skilling. Ooh, deeper pockets. Okay. Obviously a uh, thieving related one. Double loot pickpocketing. Can I use it already? No, I can't. Come on, man. Give me my 28th one. Okay, opening this should be a task. Nice. 28 coin pouches at once. Oh, first level 10. We're up to 10 thieving now. Let's get some raking content in. We've raked a farming patch. There we go. Yeah, I'm simping for the shrimp. There's a burnt shrimp, and okay. And there's 10 fishing coming in there. Hey, you can just call me Gordon Ramsay over here with the shrimps. Even more so now that I've cooked five. All right, boat people, give me your finest hammer. Thank you, task completed. And we terrorize this man again quickly for 15 thieving. Nice. Five points for different fish. And there's 15 fishing, so we'll go back to our small net, try and get an anchovy quick. And there it is. Beautiful. Let's move on to something else. All right. Fishing contest has been started. There's our first level 20 skill, 20 thieving. Just wanted a little bit more money, but I'm going to run away from the starting area now. We're going to branch out. I don't know if I activated this, so probably a good idea. There we go. Yeah, these waystone locations are going to be huge for sure. There we go. Stung by some bees. I should probably have food. I don't want to die. Let's see, we have 18 points. I think we're gonna unlock wood cutting here quick. There we go, nice little animation. Oh, look at that guy. All right, we can cut some wood now. Two wood cutting and we have chopped some logs. I can only imagine burning some logs is a task as well. Hey, there we go. Burn some logs. And I'm going to also assume that fletching some arrow shabs is a task. There we go. I think entering death's domain here is a task. Let's see. Oh, sure is. Hey, buddy. All right. Bye, buddy. And then we'll bury his bones for another task. There we go. Ah, uh, looks like they're already doing a system update. Hmm. Well, we got a minute, so I'm just gonna chop some trees until, uh, until I know what happens with this update. We are going to be shutting the game down very shortly. Unfortunately, we are required to perform a rollback to just before the launch of Leagues 3. Well. Well, you heard it there from Roydy. I was hanging out in his stream as we were all learning about what was going on. 
But yeah, about 40 to 50 minutes into leagues, they were forced to do a rollback of the main game servers only because of the league save profiles. There were some wonky things going on, but no league's progress is going to be compromised. We just got to wait for the servers to come back. Three hours later. I'm in. Let's go. Not so bottlenecked anymore. Man, these magic levels are going up like crazy. I can already water strike. Hey, 10 combat. Looking good. Oh, they just got whomped. Run. 16 magic. Go down, sir. Run. Ooh, an installed giant head. Take that. I'm going to head into the stronghold and do some agility. I'm going to get 10 agility on uh, this course right here. All right, I lifted your boxes. Let me in. Yeehaw. We've visited the gnomes. Duh, I need to unlock the skill. There we go. Now we should be getting some agility experience. There it is. Complete a lap at this uh, agility course. Already four agility. Pretty good. Hey, there we go. Ooh, 100 total level with that too. 10 agility. 100 total level. I'm going to keep exploring. All right, I just started the Grand Tree with King Narnode here. All right, I'm going to minigame Telly to Last Man Standing with this awesome new home teleport animation. And we're in the Ferox Enclave. Well, I went back to the starting area of Catherby, and I'm starting the Dwarf Cannon quest. Nice, let's talk to the Dwarf Captain guy. Would you like a Poison Chalice? Yes, please. Nice, I think I have to drink it. Yep, there we go, drink a Poison Chalice. Alright, I have 11 Renown points, I might as well unlock hit points. Get some hit points experience rocking, so I can uh, attack some more goblins. We're going to do the tutorial of uh, Barbarian Assault to get the mini game telly. All right, now we'll start collecting drinks from the bar crawl card. So let's keep exploring now. Back to the Enclave, I think. Nice, order a drink at the Old Knight. Okay, nice. All right, let's head over to Soul Wars. And we'll head over to Edgeville. Well, I'm already here. We might as well do the uh, Stronghold of Security. All right, there's... 2k cash and there's 5k cash and the final one 10k gp we are so rich now i can't even believe it how, how rich we are and i have an idea i'm gonna go down there with 10 hp and one shrimp let's try it all righty here we go and of course we're gonna choose the fancy boots Boom, there it is, equip some fancy boots. There we go, Gertrude's cat started. This beautiful waystone, let's activate it. Oh yeah, nice. I'm also going to talk to my good friend Romeo over here. We're going to start Romeo and Juliet. Gotta buy a staff of fire for the upgrade. And I'm going to continue Romeo and Juliet quick. I'm going to buy an assortment of rune packs while I'm here. I'm going to get one of every elemental pack, and then I'll buy a bunch of mind and air runes for fire strike for future combat. Ooh, while I'm over here, I'll steal from the tea stall. There's the task. Hey, we made a plank. All right, beautiful. We've defeated a guard. I'm going to go continue Romeo and Juliet and do the... Ooh, yeah, that's right. I can do the uh, museum quiz down here. That should be all of them, so I'm going to go talk to Orlando. There we go. 5k of each. Nice. Beautiful. So we're stuck... Oh, wait a minute. No. I should have saved this when I unlocked those skills, dude. That is... Dang, man, that's... yeah. I should have put more thought into that. Whatever, it's a task nonetheless. Man, I'm gonna be so salty missing out on 10k XP. Bleh. Oh well, 
I'm just here to have fun. Mistakes will be made. You know what? Thanks for the easy quest points. And the task, sir. I hope you find love down the road. Can't forget to visit the inn. First one done. Fashion upgrade the priest gown for prayer bonus and a cape. And there's the bear defeated for his meat. I'm going to kill one of these from up here just for nostalgia. Ooh, we got a skilling fragment. You've unlocked the enchanted jeweler fragment. Okay. Enchant five pieces of jewelry per enchantment. Nice. That'll be good for down the road. And we'll activate the waystone. And there we go. We started the Prince Ali rescue quest. I think I'm going to do some pickpocketing on these warriors just to get my thieving up a bit. Oh, I need 25 thieving. Dang. And we've gone through the Al Karad gate. And let's activate probably the most iconic waystone of them all. Where we would usually start this journey, Lumbridge. And there we go, I wanted to finish up 25 thieving quick. And once again, I am helping the cook with probably the 10th cake he's needed my help with. Hey, make some flour is a task, nice. And I can have a baguette. There's the cook's assistant done. Another easy quest out of the way. All right, we'll start Rune Mysteries with the Duke. There's Pickpocket a hand member. I figured while I was right next to the hideout, might as well. Hey, there's a rusty sword for the arty diary. Beautiful thing to get out of the way quickly. All right, and now that we've gotten a free trip back outside, we'll continue on. And there is one good thing about the ham hideout. I was able to get a steel axe to complete this task, as well as quite a few outfit pieces, so nice. I'm going to kill the lesser demon while I'm here. There's the demon, 25 points, decent amount. And we completed a rooftop, perfect. And we completed the drainer agility course. Um, I am now looking for a mark of grace, and then I think I'm going to go to 20 agility. Hey, there it is. There we go, we've obtained a mark of grace, perfect. All right, when we jump down, this is going to be 20 agility. So we're going to leave our friends for now. We're going to head up to the Drainer Manor. Turn that chicken into a man. Yeah, nice. There's Ernest the Chicken complete. And there's some copper ore. All right, Hetty, I got all your stuff. Let's drink from your spooky cauldron. There it is, Witch's Potion. Completed. All right, I think we're going to make our way up to Falador at this point. It only makes sense. I guess I can start the Corsair Curse quest. Oh my god, this is so dumb. Oh, close fight, dude. That was probably not worth risking, but eh, he's dead. There's the Corsair Curse complete. Where's the Waystone? There it is. Boom. Ooh, a ton of cooking XP that I didn't get. And there's Gertrude's cat completed. Running some more agility, and there's the task for the Al Karid agility course. There's 30 agility. Ooh, tier 3. Nice. We've reached a new tier. Check the fragments panel for the new passive effects you've unlocked. Medium task, achieve your first level 30. And I've unlocked the holy wizard fragment. Well, the unholy wizard fragment. We slap that magic relic on. Nice, so that creates a set effect. What is that, chain magic? So after a successful magic attack, you have a chance to do another magic attack roll. Not only that, but my account is now times eight XP multiplier, so I just got a huge boost. All right, gamers, we're going to end the first Shattered Relics League video here. Very excited to have gotten to tier three. The XP is about to go up. We're about to be booming. 
I'm having a lot of fun so far. It's a really interesting concept, a lot of ways to navigate through the game with unlocking skills and bosses. So really looking forward to see where this goes and what path I decide to take. The main thing, I'm just gonna try and have as much fun along the way as I can. So plenty of content coming where this came from. If you enjoyed this first video, give it a like and please consider subscribing to the channel for future leagues content. And as always, I'm Kay Wiley and I'll see you next time.